Okay, so if you saw the hashtag Love in Bloom trending online not that long ago, it's because fans were falling head over heels for the romantic movie of the same title, which is about a Chicago florist who finds herself in quite the sticky situation while trying to help save a couple's wedding. But luckily, she has some positive reinforcements. Take a look. One bad review from August Ivy from Coast to Country magazine is like a hundred bad reviews from everyone else. But what did she say? He said that he thinks I lost my touch. And I think he might be right. Right, I know what we need to do. What? We're getting you out of here. Well, what about the seating arrangement? Mrs. Poppy is more than capable of doing the seating plan. Uh... You're right, you'll have everyone playing musical chairs all night. Something tells us sparks are gonna fly. Well, we'll see how much our next guest gives away. You may just recognize her from Marvel's Jessica Jones, uh, Chicago Med, and The Forever Purge. She acts, she sings, she writes, she produces, and has a heck of a swing. Let's show some love for my bestie and my headsie, Miss Susie Abramo. Hey. I just said, people are gonna be like, what are they dancing to? What are they hearing? We're both going like. It's the music inside our heads. You, you can't stop us. Right? And that's what happens when we're around you, because everything you touch just blooms, literally. This dress was oh. gray before you showed up, Susie. <laughs> I'm just saying, I don't know what magic you're doing, and which is why people are just loving this movie. And I'm sure you feel the love you've gotten, the response you've gotten so far from this movie. It's, it's been really incredible. I mean, you know, we, we were uh, trending on Twitter, trying to say that 10 times fast. And yeah, it, it was, I mean, the outpouring of love, it's, it's you know, you, you uh, work really hard on a film and uh, me and the, the cast and the crew and just everyone put their heart and soul into it. Uh, Rogue did a fantastic job directing this, Rogue Rubin and, um, you know, she really worked so hard on this. And, and Julian, who was fantastic, he was just such a great counterpart. And, and you know, he was a perfect teammate. And uh, Jason Wilder, who uh, was also fantastic, and Melina and Candace and all these, our, our cast and crew, we yeah. were just laughing the entire time. And we just had a ball. So I feel like everyone watching just felt the same like i think everyone responded to that so you know it's it's great when you you do something and it turns out great and people love it and yeah i mean that's all you can hope for listen so i know flowers and a wedding are involved like we explained so if life happened to imitate art susie and you had to help someone out with a wedding and or mm -hmm. their floral arrangements how well do you think you're going to do after having worked on this movie uh, you know what? I'm actually um, going to be helping out uh, a wedding and giving speeches and, and, in like a couple months uh, for one of my best friends, Alexandra. So I feel like, you know, um, it's interesting because I'm also a producer. So there's always like, in, in, when it comes to a wedding, there's always sometimes like fires to put out and, you know, you're trying to fill in the spaces of how can I be helpful? How can I contribute? How can I make this the easiest possible day for the bride. Uh, yeah, I, I, I definitely think like, you know, putting the producer hat on and just trying to figure off. out how I can there's, problem solve is the way nothing, to do it. There is nothing you cannot do. And I'm glad you said one of your best friends, Alexandra, because if you said your best friend, Alexandra, we're going to have problems. But I'm glad you said <laughs> one of. So I'm listening to you, one of. So I'm, I'm glad you clarified that. And as your bestie, you know I'm super proud four picture deal with GAC family, which is yes. which is just uh, no easy feat. The last time you were here was, was for your Christmas movie. Now we have Love and Bloom, which by the way, you guys shot in Australia and you've been traveling a lot lately, bestie, without me. That's good to know. Mm. <laughs> Thank you. We have to plan a trip. Right. I mean, yes, we have to. So I'm actually going to, uh, I'm making another trip. So you're going to have to, we're going to have to figure out some so places where, where have to you go been to. So far? Where have you been going? Oh my God. So I was in Israel. I was in Palestine. I was doing this whole, uh, you know, the, the, the place, the birthplace of Jesus, where he died, where he resurrected, okay. uh, Masada, um, okay, uh, Bethlehem. And I just, I wanted to, I just, I felt very, uh, it was on my bucket list for the longest time for about 10, 15 years. Oh, wow. And I finally was able to do that. Oh. And yeah, I went to London. I went to New York, which is one of my favorite cities in the whole wide world. Wait. Just saying. Are those shoots for Vogue or are they just your regular pictures? 
Are they Vogue I just shoots? Rank... What, are, what, are you, what is that? Like a magazine cover? What is go Vanity Fair? Like my vacation no. photos do not look like that. They do not. But you also look. It's a, it was a lot of photos. Oh, please. It was a lot of still, photos. Like, they all look so nice. I was like, what in the magazine cover is happening here? I need to take lessons. What in the so, magazine wait, cover? So you live in Utah right now, which I know is lovely. Yes. And I'm, I'm coming to move yes. into the garage. You said that's OK. But <laughs> since you were like, because uh, everyone knows that you, I, I, said, I say this all the time, you're great at everything you do. Tennis is also on your resume because you were ranked top 10 at some point when you were in college. Yeah. So uh, now mean, that the yeah, U.S. For, Open for is juniors. It doesn't matter. Juniors, <laughs> juniors seniors, in the United States. Juniors, seniors, middle-aged, I haven't ranked top anything. So sorry, Susie, it doesn't matter what it is. We were still <laughs> top 10 at some point. So the U.S. Open is happening now. Serena's wobbing us all. Do you pay attention <sighs> to that stuff? Um, well, interestingly enough, I had worked on uh, King Richard. Uh, and, and so I got to... I met Serena when I was playing, like when I was 18 and she was so cool. She was so awesome. I wasn't, it, she was, she was a little bit older than me and she was like at this point, you know, winning grand oh. slams and uh, Serena. So I met Serena and Venus and they were just, um, they were, she's just so cool, you know? Um, and yeah, I, I ended up doing, I was working with Will Smith for King Richard. Yeah, and so then I got to reconnect with their family. And um, it was it was really, really cool of just hearing the stories and, and sitting down with uh, Serena's sister. And yeah, it was, it was, it was a really cool, cool project too, to be a part of. It. You're cool too, because you didn't get arrested. As a teenager, you're meeting Serena Williams and you <laughs> knew how to behave yourself. This one will have like a, uh, like a rap sheet out for the first time because it'd be like, oh, for acting up because I will not be able to control myself. But you were super cool too because that tennis picture we I got saw, into trouble at times. No, sure, sure, Susie. <laughs> and look where your trouble has have all brought you. So keep getting in trouble. We're going to keep loving it. After a lot of lessons. Yo, please, yeah. Susie. Lies you tell to me. Lies you tell. All right, I'll see you. I'll be in the garage if you need me. Just head on downstairs. No, and no, you, you're welcome to stay here. Not in the garage. Okay, then. I have you, wonderful, yeah, I have wonderful is. extra bedrooms. <laughs> Everyone heard that. Everyone heard that. Yes. Utah, yes. here I come. While I go to Utah, you guys, this weekend, you can check out her movie, Love in Bloom on Great American Family, also known as GAC Family. It airs on Saturday and Sunday night. Happy weekend, Susie. Enjoy your weekend. I might be in Utah for the weekend, so um, I'll see you then. Oh, my God. I'll be Let blooming. Me know, please. I'll be blooming. Oh, my God. Please let me know. I'm, I'm, I'm here and waiting. Right. Bye. Be careful what you wish for. <laughs>